Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Good morning today. Hello, Irene. Good morning, teacher. Hello, good morning. How are you today? I'm very good. <laughs> and you? I'm pretty good. Thank you for asking. How was your weekend? I think very well. And I visit my boyfriend and we pass a, a very good time. That's good. Uh, where do you, uh, where do you do you travel to another uh, place? I mean, another like, for example, Santa Ana or something like that. No, uh, it's inside San Salvador in, in Mexicanos. Ah, that's good. So, do you live near? Mm, a little. <laughs> a little. I'm from Planes de Renderos. Ah, okay, nice. That's good. So, yeah, it's kind of quiet, far away. But the good, part, the good thing is that you spend time with your boyfriend. That's good. Oh, that was on Saturday or on Sunday? And on Saturday. That's good. I, mm -hmm. I was in, in her, in her apartment, in his apartment, uh -huh. uh, Saturday and Sunday. That's good. That's amazing. So I can mind that uh, you'll really enjoy it. Yes. That's good. I'm so enjoy happy. <laughs> that's good. That's good. Uh, before anything else, I want to say good morning to everybody. And thank you for being on time. Good morning, Josue, Nelson, and as well you, Irene. Uh, let's see. Today we have the session number nine. We have a speaking activities for today. So let me ask you a quick question about... Can you read it, please? Okay. Uh, what topics do you remember about the last week? Uh -huh. What do you remember? Um, well, we were talking on Friday about the present perfect continuous, right? Uh, mm -hmm. We're discussing the structure, the grammar structure. Mm -hmm. um, when we practice a little with some examples, I remember we said that this um, is, that this uh, is about um, situations where something happened, but it continues in the present. I mm -hmm. think mm -hmm. that's what I remember. Okay, perfect. So I need just to do a review as that you are right. We were talking, that was on Friday, that's right, about present continuous versus present perfect. So you're gonna work with your groups and you're gonna just review, for example, remember that we have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, la, 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 la. So you have to tell me what other topics do you remember for the next week, for the last week, I'm sorry. So you're gonna be with a partner for three minutes to remember those topics. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Okay, so let's go. Three minutes, remember? What do you remember about last week?
Luis. Hello, Luis. Hi, good morning. Hello. Hi, hi. <laughs> uh, we need to talking about the the topics in the last week. Ah, okay. Uh, for example, uh, I can start first. Uh, I remember we we was uh, talking about past simple and present and present perfect. I remember, for example, uh, I have done is the present perfect or the past is I have read a book the last week. I read a book the last week, for example. Yes. Do you um. remember another topic? Um uh, well uh I, I remember um we we learned some phrases uh like hit the jackpot, kill me posted, uh no picnic, uh yes. Yes. One one in a while. Uh, out of luck, I, I remember these two phrases. <laughs> well, you have to add the auxiliary have and an adverb in a participle. In present perfect continuous, you have to add the being, the have been and something. So that's the difference. But present perfect continuous. You add the verb in e and ENG in the last, I think. No, yes, but you before the verb you have to add the being. Have been when you told me the example, you told me that had I have been something. So that is a present perfect continuous. Without being is a present perfect, just perfect. <laughs> Okay. Well, with the perf present perfect continuous, um, the last week I, oh, I don't know. <clears throat> Hello, good morning. How are you? I'm fine. Very good. And what do you remember about last week? About what we were studying? Uh, well, basically last week I don't participate because now it was on vacations. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, I didn't realize. Yeah, after a year and a couple of months. Did you travel or something? No, just no. rest, basically. Just at home? Yeah, basically. Right. Like, Mm. But what what is supposed to do right now? Talking about childhood and stuff like that. Um, no, talking about the all what the what we remember about the topics of the last week. Oh, okay, okay. And we we studied about present perfect. Present perfect continuous and past simple, for example. Okay. Hello, everybody. Hello. Hello. Okay, hello. Okay, so can you re just remind me a quick way? What were the topics that you were discussing or we were uh, practicing the last week? You said somebody said present perfect continuous. What was the other topic? Mm -hmm. Simple past. 
Very good. What else? It's missing one more topic. Team present perfect. Okay, perfect. So now let's move to another activity. Let's see, Nelson, <clears throat> I'm sorry. Can you read the next uh, slide? Uh, what, ch what chores do you do at home? And what chores do you do at work? Okay, do you know what I'm meaning for chores? No. It's like duties. Repeat? It's, it's like duties. Very good. For example, can you give me an idea for duties at home? Um. Yeah. Basically, when I I wake from my uh from my bed, I try to set set up set up again or uh -huh. cleaning. I don't know how to say that. Or wash the dishes, for example. Mm -hmm. Or stuff like that. Basically, it's like um activities that we do or in home or at work, basically. Okay, very good, excellent. Yeah, so it's like housework is the meaning for shorts and duties are the same shorts, but for work, we call it duties. Let me give you an example and then you discuss with your different partners, okay? Okay, we have, for example, different kind of shorts. This is most for the house. We have clean the house. And uh, let's see, Rocio, can you read the first five? First five. Uh-huh. Yes, okay. Clean the house. Go to my English class. Stay at home. Go shopping. Make the dinner. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. Okay, okay. very good. Uh, Rocio, choose the next volunteer. Uh, Josue. Hi. Uh, let me see. Spend time with my friends. Wash the dirty dishes, go in the kitchen, take out take out the trash, and do the laundry. Very good, Jose. Next volunteer. Um, Rodrigo. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, tidy up the bedroom, make the bed, vacuum, dust, mow the lawn, mm -hmm. and go shopping. Next volunteer, Rodrigo. Uh, uh, let me check. Victor. Okay. <laughs> uh, well, uh, let's put the next one is, let me see. Uh, cook, cook dinner, mm -hmm. um, set the table, um, clear the table, watch a movie, um, listen to music. Very good. Next volunteer, Victor. Um, let's see. Oh, victim. <laughs> okay, Irene. Okay, good. Okay, just. Yes. Sorry, I can see all the complete image. Oh. The one for this side. Let me show you. Okay, here. Oh, thank you. Uh, sleep the whole day, <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> go to the gym, do my nails, play with my son daughter, and play video games. Okay, volunteer, Irene. Okay, um, Luis. Uh, okay, yes, um, play video games, cook. No, mm -hmm. do the laundry, do the dishes, go for full shopping, make the bed, mop the floor. Okay, Rodrigo, choose next volunteer. <laughs> Rodrigo or me? It was Luis, you choose the ah, okay. next volunteer. Okay. <laughs> Uh, uh Rocio? Okay. <laughs> um I am lost. <laughs> the last five. Okay. Here. Yes. Uh-huh. Is do laundry? Mm -hmm. What do the dishes? The dishes go full shopping, make the bed, mop the floor. 
Continue. Okay. Uh, mow the lawn, put the house in order, straight up, uh, sweep the floor, take out the, the garbage, eat vacuum. Okay, vacuum. So some of them are like repeated, but this is just to pay in order that you remember those. Okay, so let me ask you once again, what are the activities that you do at home? If you help your, your family to do the dishes, what do you usually do or who does in your family? And what do these do you do your, in your work? In your case, you set the table, you clean the, the, the desk, you check the computer. I want to know that, okay? So you're gonna have four minutes to work with your partner and discuss the question. How much time do you have? Five minutes. Five. Four minutes. Four minutes. Ah, okay. Are you gonna talk about do this or are you gonna talk about colors? There is. Do this. Okay, so you're gonna have two rounds. Let's go. Let's see about your duties and the shorts. The duties we do at yes at home. Okay. Uh, I I used to cook in my house, for example. Uh, we need yeah. to do examples. Good. And. Yes, I think. Mm. Wash the dishes in at home. Uh, uh, vacuum the floor. Yes, that is, and also. In my case, I also cook the dinner, for example, sometimes. <laughs> and I try to tidy up the my bedroom. Um, almost my of oh, at least my 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 bed all the mornings. And. I do the laundry two two times per week. Sometimes I go shopping and on weekends. And I don't go to the gym, but I try to to exercise. And at home, uh, three times a week. Trash can that I have, I, I, clean, I clean that, I clean it. Um, what else? Yes, on cables, clothes. Well, I, I think, uh, I don't know, if you arrange the chair. Yes. Yes, clean, clean, clean the, and, and clean the, the space around the, the desk. More related to the floor. Uh, what else? Uh, 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 one other one other thing is I have an an humidifier humidifier, so I I fill it with water. <laughs> Well, in my case, um, I drink uh, a lot of water. So, uh, in in the day, I watch the the bottle uh, a lot of times. Uh, I have a I I have a whiteboard, so m most of the time because I'm I'm using it, I, I need to like being uh, 
like uh, erasing all the tasks that I done or all the reminders. Or sometimes I use post-its, uh, so taking out them and putting it into the trash. Okay. Um. Oh, in my case, I don't know. <laughs> um, I have a, a plant in my desk. In my desk, um, sometimes I push water in the in that plant, and I clean the the <clears throat> the area of that plant. Um, what is the, the word for fregar? For, for, for fregar? No, regar. Eh. Ah. Uh, um, what are water plants? <laughs> yes. Uh, yes. I, 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 so, some while ago, I bought a timer. Uh, so it's like a timer for uh, those that some chef uses in the kitchen so uh, i try to use it to set the, to set timers between uh well between working periods of time most of the time i set it for 25 minutes or 30 minutes and the idea is not to do it not to distract a, in a, between that period of, be, between that range of time no, oh, this is a this is a good practice. <laughs> At least I try. <laughs> yes. Great. And basically, that's that that activity I do around two or three months at the beginning, then. Uh, well, most of the times the scrum master have uh, six stances. Basically, uh, I always start with the, with the coaching and also the the teacher stance. But then I move to the to the leader or manage because most of the times the times up. Uh, well, is is not supposed to happen in that way. But um, in Aplaudo the view of the Scrum Master is to keep or try to solve any kind of situation on, or misunderstanding with the customer, facing the customer. Most of the times I have to do like uh, the, the, the duties or the chores like uh, PM, for example. We need, I need to run some reports about the, um, the efficiency of the team, for example, uh, have internal meeting with the customer to try to explain the situation. If we have a over workload or not, why don't get the what? Why the the team don't achieve the 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 scrum goal? For example, I have to talk about that situation. Try to reorder the product roadmap if if we have product roadmap in the in the team, or if not, uh, try to update the user story mapping, which is other tool. Basically, uh, you can use to check uh, the forecasting for the team and uh, stuff like that, basically. Okay, nice. Uh, yeah. Yes. Uh, most of my... Uh, <laughs> yeah. So if I do... Sorry. I don't know what, in what time we, we, we're switching. <laughs> Okay. No. Yes, it was. Yeah. Yes. Kind. Kind of a sudden. The, the change. For that, and for that, uh, the most of the time, I, I, I decide, decided to to buy the lunch every day. Okay, and I understand. Yes, if I, if. I could be in your, in your, in your, I don't know how to say, in your situation also, I, I will uh, buy my, my lunch also in, in that kind of store. 
Yes, uh, the word that we are finding is noon. Ah, uh, mm. right. Midnight is at night. <laughs> yes. <laughs> In the noon. Yes. Um. Then in this in these days that we are in, in English classes at noon. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, at noon. Okay. At noon. Yes. Ah, uh, we used to to have my breakfast late. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I I tried to to take my breakfast before the class, but. I think sometimes I, I'm eating very quickly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sometimes me too. But my, but I prepare the breakfast for my dogs early. <laughs> oh, great! Uh, how many dogs do you have? I have two dogs, and um, Slack and Goliath. <laughs> These are the names. Slack. Like a great name. <laughs> <laughs> like the application that we yes. use. <laughs> Lang. It's a very, a very, yes. We, um, I don't know. Uh, I, I do everything, but. Uh, do you map, do you map the floor? The floor? Yes, I, uh, the floor. You um, order everything. <laughs> yes. <coughs> I watch my, my, my three pets. You have uh, three? Yes, I have three girls. <laughs> Cats or dogs? No, dogs. I love dogs. Uh, yes. I, I, I don't hate the, the, the cats, but I don't like the cats. Only dogs. I see. Uh -huh. Yes, I rescue uh, three dogs. Oh, all of them are rescued. Yes, all uh, all of them. They are oh, adopted. Uh, you adopted them. Uh -huh. yes, yes, I adopted three three pets. I love, I love that. <laughs> That's nice. Yes, she are well. well she is. Um, I don't know. Um, I have three. One name is uh, Elizabeth Taylor. The other <laughs> is Mimi, but I sometimes I call her uh, Mini Berta. And the mm -hmm. other is Belen. <laughs> Belen. Yes, they are so strong. They are big dogs or small? Uh, big dogs. I in the so um, I think is well. I thought that are uh, uh, small, but <laughs> no. They are uh, like like a well one like a pastor alemán mixo with uh, oh. other other uh, race. Mm -hmm. uh, the other is mixed with uh, with a uh, pit bull, and the other with uh, chow chow. Ah, oh, I see. <laughs> yes, <laughs> but uh -huh. I am happy. Uh -huh. I had a chow chow. Uh, oh, chow chow. Yes. So yes, I had one uh, like 10 years ago. It's, it's a, a major dog. No, she is not with me. Uh, ah, is, is she? Is girl? Yeah, yes, she was a girl. Hello, everybody. Hello. 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 Okay, welcome back. Okay, let's uh, move on to the next activity. I want to listen to some of you. So let's see one volunteer. Let's see. Ah, 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 wait, give me one second. Let's see, let me listen to volunteers. Josue Torres. So tell me, even the duties or the chores? You decide. What I do, right? Or... Uh -huh, what do you do? Ah, uh, okay. Okay, uh, let's pick the first one. Uh, what chores? 
do you do at home? Well, in my case, on the week, I try to mop the floor like two or three times. Nice. Um, also, I always forget <laughs> to wash the dishes, so I'm trying to get the habit of washing it every time I have uh, lunch, dinner, or whatever. Nice. Yeah. So I'm trying to wash them every day. Um, let me see. I also clean the house in general. I mean, sometimes my dogs uh, like disorder the the things. I mean, like their own food. The I don't know. I have some soccer ball so they play with them and they uh, crash some things i don't know uh, so i try to reorder to put the things in order mm -hmm. uh, and i clean the kitchen and the fridge like to like once every every two weeks nice so i think that's kind of the things i do okay that's good the good is that you try to have a uh, the as you say, the habits. In my case, I pile up all of the dishes. Um, <laughs> at the end of the day, or maybe the next day, uh, I try to wash it. But it's I a see. habit I have. <laughs> okay, so let's see, Rocio, thank you. You're going to give me one idea. Uh -huh. What about you? Well, in my case, um, the chores I do is sometimes I split this, the floor. Mm -hmm. and. I wash the dishes, I clean the, the windows, um, um, I watch uh, my three pets, <laughs> and I don't know, I clean the garden, uh, I, I shake the, the, the desk, the desk, the, the table, mm -hmm. um, only that, I think. Nice. Do you do it almost every day? Um, yes, yeah, sometimes because I have uh, three pets. So sometimes it's difficult because uh, <laughs> they are some, sometimes they are doing a disaster in my, in my home. <laughs> oh my God. But yeah, you are so responsible. In my case, I'm not, <laughs> but that's good. That's amazing. So let me just complete this part about, uh, this is an idea for the goodies that we have in my case. Uh, in my case, I do the dishes at the table one single week. I clean my room, the house, and I sweep the floor. I hate, I'm sorry, I hate sweeping the floor. And I clean the classroom. I, in my case, I work. I erase the board. I set the desk and I check the books. Now, let me ask you, well, we're gonna have a different activity. Let's see, Luis, can you read the next activity, please? Okay. Uh, take a look at the pics. Mm -hmm. uh, write a story based on Barbara's recent activities. Complete the sentences using present perfect continuous and the verb in brackets. Don't be afraid to be creative and punctuate, punctuate carefully. Okay, so this is a, she's Barbara, okay? So we're gonna do it in a quick way. For example, we have number one. We have Barbara is really tired because, and that's my example. We have, because she has been working until 7 p.m. the whole week. That's my point of view. So let's see, uh, I need your help. <coughs> You're gonna complete the other ones. So Luis, you're gonna have two, Nelson three, Victor four, Irene five, eh, Josue six, Raquel seven, eh, Rocio eight, Rodrigo nine, and I'm gonna have number 10. So you're Sorry. gonna have- what, What's my-, my... <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God, I think that is number two. Number okay. Two. <laughs> okay, you have 30 seconds, 30 to think a possible answer, okay? Don't give me yet, 30 seconds.
Nine seconds. Okay, number two. Louis, tell me, Barbara's eyes are red because? Uh, because she has been uh, reading, so watching soap operas until 1 a.m. <laughs> okay, what's up opera? Uh -huh. Give me a name for one. <laughs> ah, novela. Ah, uh, tell Rosa me. de Guadalupe. No oh sé. my God. <laughs> okay, perfect. Number three. Barbara has left very worried because uh, as she. Who has... wants to use it? <laughs> number three. Oh, you are number three, Nelson. Ah, okay, okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, Barbara has felt very wor worried as she. Ah, okay, because he he has been um, because he she she has been married with someone that he doesn't uh, love. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is sound like the, the Rosa de Guadalupe, okay? <laughs> okay, that's perfect, super good. Number four, Barbara's job is really important for her. She... Uh, well, she, she has been working uh, in the same company for 20 years. Amazing, perfect. Number five, Barbara gained a couple of kilograms because she... She hasn't been exercising uh, the last two months. Okay, that's the case. This is my case of Barbara, okay, super. <laughs> Number six. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, Barbara feels happy because she has been attending museums in Paris recently. Super good. Number seven. Barbara loves Dessert, dessert, and she has been cooking chocolate cake with her mom every New Year since she was a teenager. I love it. Excellent. Now I, I feel hungry. I'm starving. Okay, super. Number eight. Okay, by Barbara has a beautiful voice. In fact, she sings um, rock and reggae in uh, she in the church choir uh, the church choirs <laughs> okay perfect i gave my somebody singing in the in the church reggae okay perfect number nine barbara's boyfriend is really nice they ah uh, this, this is mine right uh -huh. uh, barbara's boyfriend is really nice uh they meet uh in the in the Plaudo three years ago because uh she was a developer and he and he was the the pm for the project and they start uh, dating and and now they get married oh. <laughs> i don't know everything is possible in the Plaudo. <laughs> That's cool. yeah basically but i, I like the, the number eight is a jamaican church oh okay hey, actually yes yeah, some people from jamaica they use the, the hat, right? With three colors. Yeah. I see a lot of kind of weird music for the church in Jamaica in TikTok. Yeah, but yeah, that's what I really like. <laughs> okay. And the last one, Barbara leaves her office at six because she, somebody can give me an idea. Volunteer, just one. Uh, Barbara leaves her office that sees be because she uh, she uh, played with the band for the church to create a new Jamaica <laughs> song for the next. Uh, I don't know how to say Misa. Ah, that's that's a good question. I don't know. Let so me look. For, the, ah. for the next session <laughs> uh, in the next uh, six months. 
<laughs> okay, and she's yeah, she's practicing, right? She's taking a course how to take the guitar, how to play the guitar. Okay, <laughs> okay, excellent. By the way, the word I found mass. is mass, 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 like this. But I'm gonna double check. I'm not sure about that one. Okay, that's excellent. You have a good imagination. <laughs> now let's do some practice activity. Raquel, can you read the instructions? Oh, the slide? The first one? Yes. Uh, what is the latest project that you have been working on? For example, I have been working on... <laughs> I have been working, <laughs> working on... <laughs> Um, weather matter for one month. <laughs> okay, excellent. Okay, so that's what I want. You have three minutes to work with your partner and talk about your uh, projects, okay? So in my case, the latest project I have been working on, uh, learning French, or I have been working on creating a conversation club, okay? So I need that you tell me what and how long, is it easy, difficult, or is still working on, okay? So three minutes per pair. So let's go. Question is, um, what is the latest project that you have been working on? Okay, in my case, I have been working um, in a data warehouse project for Miami Heat clients. That's cool. And in your case? Well, um, well, in my case, I have been uh, working uh, on Cereza. Cereza is the name of the project for oh, more cool. than for more than two years, <laughs> and and it's oh, weird. Wow. It, it's it's weird because usually um, um, developers only work in a project for a few months, <laughs> but in my case, um. Have. Yes, like like three months almost four, and I think I'll be there at least for two or three months more. Well, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let me tell you that I have been working on the same project for one year at the uh, mm, two. Uh, one years ago mm -hmm. in Multimoney. Oh, really? Mm, yes. <laughs> What's your role? I I have been working like a QA. Oh, yeah, you? I see. I am Android develop, developer. Okay. Yes. And before of that, uh, you do you have been working on another project? Um, yes, um, before Multimonia, I was working uh, in another team on Black Hawk. Uh, yes, do you know that project? Yes, I I have a a, a friend working in this in this project. Oh really? Is it Nelson or yes. Ah, <laughs> Nelson. Uh -huh. yes, I was. I was on the same team with him. We were working in a tedious project for the uh, company Blackhawk. I worked there for let me see, almost almost a year. Yes, from April to the first weeks of January, if I'm not mistaken, uh -huh. almost a year. And after uh, let me see, yeah, I don't know what happened, but my project manager told me that uh, Multimoney was looking for some people because they were like uh, needing uh, some people to develop some things or I really wanted to change. So I decided to change to that project and I'm yes. here now. I have heard in, in Multimoney, there are a lot of people working on the activities. Yes. 
because the time is short to finish. I understand that. Understood that. Mm -hmm. And you said you are now working on weathermatic, or that was before? Uh, I was working on weathermatic only for one month. Oh, I see. Yeah, and uh, but currently uh -huh. I'm working with I'm working on Ceresa project in Ceresa. Uh, what is the other? Uh, um, Gaff Energy. Uh huh. I see. Uh, I'm you, curious. About do you heard about that? To, to, to complete. Wow. Well, uh, in 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 your case, um, what is the, 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 the how long have you been in that toy in the project? Just two months, but I don't. I don't. I. Right now, I I am not in in a project. I am a, and in that project, I I was used two months because, I you I was used. Uh, I don't know how to say, um, cubriendo, <laughs> and vacation as for other for. For the vacation of other person, oh, okay. of, of other programmer. But I, I learned a lot of 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 that project because that was my first project in Aplaudo. Mm. Uh, uh, you are a, a a developer, right? Yes, uh, big data engineer. So I in that project I was uh, managing and and building. ETL processes and for a, a data warehouse. Sounds good. That's interesting. Well, uh, um, in my case, I work as a backend developer, <clears throat> sometimes as a technical leader, but yeah. but it is that the, the, the team is small. We um, in the past, we have a big uh, team with uh, eight or nine developers because oh. we, we 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 create the application from scratch, so they need a lot of uh, developers. But since we are only uh, uh, working on some uh, small pictures, uh, they don't need <laughs> a, a a big uh, uh, they don't need a, a big team, just um, and also because the uh, uh, economic situation, I think. Um, okay. Um, because it, they they was they 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 were affected a little bit by the when the when a bank in the U.S. broke, uh, the Silicon Valley Bank. So yeah. they, they were affected by a little bit for that. <laughs> yes, I understand that. It's affecting to all the cloud also. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> hello. Welcome back. Hello, hello. Hello, welcome back. Okay. Hello. <laughs> okay, let's move on to the next activity, the next question, and then we have another activity. The next question is, uh, Nelson, can you read it, please? Yeah, of course. Mention some projects that you have done in your job. Okay, so projects. Remember, uh, you, have a, you are in a new job. What do you remember until now? You can say in my current job, I have, for example, I have done these uh, meetings, ta, 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 ta. I have worked, ta, 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 ta. I have created, prepared, and what is developed? What is the meaning for developed of a synonym? Oh, they are. Okay, very good. So in this case, for example, in your case, you can say I have developed a program or a project about this, or I have prepared a meeting. So I need to know what about you? What projects you have done for this year? 
Mm -hmm. uh, but the question say some projects. I don't know if is the proper word or because you are looking for duties, basically. That's right. By this guy kind of projects, you can say, uh, yes, it could be for duties or something that you you can say that is a project for you. Uh, an example. Uh, in knowing this job, well, in the previous job, uh, the project was to create a English academy. Okay, so uh, I developed like uh, uh, the lesson plans idea how to create the, the English academy. Okay, in that case, was my pro it was not my duties at all, but it was more for a project. Mm. <clears throat> okay, okay, got it. Okay, so there you go. You are going to have four minutes, remember? Not only your duties, but it was something more that you had to develop or to create in your job. So you're going to have four minutes to practice, and then you're going to tell me. Oh, really? <coughs> what do you have? Sorry? What do you have? Blue or uh, something. Uh, I feel uh, sick for my throat. Um, okay. Yes. Okay. I'll see. Well, also, I have a, a kind of flu, I guess. But yeah. Is the, the weather, the changing weather right now. But yeah. Uh, I don't know, Rocio, do you want to start? Or do you prefer I'm start with a question? Yes, I, I, I'm a start. Okay. okay, in my current job, I have, um, I have worked in a, I have worked, um, you know, test uh, some applications, like uh, multi-money. <laughs> <laughs> I am still... In, in I am still in multi money, and in sometimes I create uh, test cases, prepare the the, the data, um, uh, I don't know, only that I think. Okay, yeah, okay, that's really cool. Well, in my current job, I have um create, for example, uh, or updating most of the times uh, some reports about metrics from the, the entire teams. <clears throat> well, right now I have four teams in, in Blackhawk, so that's create or update any kind of report is multiplied by four. And also I create uh, some presentation in PowerPoint to, for example, to run the retrospective, the reviews with the customer. Uh, also, I have a lot of internal meetings with the customer. So I have to create uh, some presentation using data and also prepare the, uh, all the information related to the, to the, um, to, the prog uh, to the progress for the, for the project to my, to my boss. Well, we run a half, uh, we run some internal meetings to to double check the situation about uh, the projects that, that's do internally, and also develop. Uh, well, it's not develop like a coding. It's more create the a structure for the next uh, Agile Academy, which is running in a couple of months. So I have to uh, looking for information about some uh, framework, for example, Kanban, uh, Scrum, extreme programming, and stuff like that. And also, I have to work with uh, with uh, some peers uh, for the same department to 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 create that um, or developing the all the structure for the academy. Uh, most of the time, that's they might. I I will working with different technologies that I that I, uh, in that time didn't didn't know. Uh, another project really interesting was Artemis. Artemis was uh, an uh, interesting 
project, well, the idea of the of, of the Artemis, it was really fantastic. Uh, I I have been well in I I I worked uh, for the create the diagram from C, from zero and um, infrastructure as code two, and we have to use an a VPN because. Uh, we found a problem that linking uh, we can we can they have some other differences but I'm still not that uh, aware of them okay. on uh, my case uh, also I have I have been watching many videos and uh, about the the logic of the project because there are a lot of information for the new people uh, when the new people is uh, is hired in the project and uh, there are a lot of information to to see <laughs> before mm -hmm. of that i see so you're like in kind of in onboarding yes i I have been into these two weeks uh, on onboarding in the two projects. Hello, hello. Hello. Okay, hello. hello. Okay, I was listening to some of your products and they are super interesting. Okay, so let's just move on to two things before you go. I want to ask you how, uh, wait, is it good to say we was? We were. Okay, very good. We were. What about spend, uh, you can say spend money, spend time with my family. So what is the past of spend? Spend. Okay. How do you say yo no, for example, yo no trabajé? I don't. I, did, I didn't. Okay, you would use I didn't. For example, I didn't work with the verb in present. And by the way, uh, I have a new word for you of vocabulary is feeling for someone. For example, I can say, I I am feeling for my partner. Do you know what you're feeling in? No. Okay, for example, when you have a medical leave or for example, somebody is pregnant and the person has to leave for three or four months, I guess. When you take the place of that person for three or four months, you can say, I'm filling in for Marta. I'm filling in for uh, okay. uh -huh. That means that you are basically, the another synonym is covering of, uh, the, the position of that person for a certain time. Okay, but you don't say covering. You say the word I am filling in for, okay? Okay. Okay, and one more thing, it's just as a reminder for this evaluated homework, Please, uh, I'm gonna send this in, as in the group. Remember, you had to present that. It's a recording and it's for five minutes. And you have to include like today. I have been working for uh, a project for five days and first I do this, second. So you have to mix all of the information that you have been talking uh, during the classes in, that, in those five minutes, okay? Any question? And for when we have to do uh, by Wednesday. Okay. Uh -huh. And remember, you have to say my name is Rodrigo Reyes, and, and you start talking for those five minutes. Okay. No questions for today. Uh, it's a, it's, in, it's a, sorry. Go ahead. Uh, thanks. In the later uh, homework, we have to to talk about the topics. You can. Use, you can, for you can talk about your duties like today, 
when you can use present perfect, present perfect continuous sequencing and used to. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. This okay. is basically a mix of all of that. Okay. Any other question, Victor? No. Yes, um, it's a recording, right? Is do we have to send you by where? <laughs> uh, uh, through WhatsApp, you can send it to my personal oh. WhatsApp and say, my name is Victor. Uh, remember, for example, you have to like the first activity that you did, that you were explaining. For example, I'm a teacher, I work from home, and I have been teaching from home since the last year, and I have done some projects. First, I my duty, and you can say your duties and about or about your project. Uh, the last year, I used to work with a partner, something like you can use all of the information together. Okay. Is, okay. Is it clear? Yes. Like the Coke? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's clear, teacher. Okay. Like I said, water, water. I okay. Said water. <laughs> no, I said water. Okay. It was a pleasure to see you today. Talk to you tomorrow. Being connected <clears throat> time. And take care. Bon appetit. Bye. Good day. Bye. Take care. See you. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.